What's up guys, Safa Ashraf here. Today I'm going to be going through my iPhone 13 wishlist. Let's start off with number one, a high refresh rate display. Okay, so I think we've heard this enough, but high refresh displays are necessary. Apple mentioned that the average consumer won't notice the difference between 60 and 120, and the average consumer won't need it. Well, surprise, surprise, I'm the average consumer here, and I really, really want a 120Hz display. That's one of the main things keeping me away from iPhones. I would have really liked to get the iPhone 12 Pro Max this year, but sadly, it the, the only thing it was missing for me personally was 120Hz. So yes, Apple, please add your ProMotion displays into the iPhone 13 or iPhone 12s, whatever you name it. But yes, ProMotion displays, 120Hz, it's necessary now. Point number two. USB-C. Nearly everything I use on the daily is USB-C compatible. My MacBook Pro, my phone and all my accessories have USB-C. If I was to buy an iPhone 13 or iPhone 12 S and it did not have USB-C it would probably make a problem for me as I would have to bring around an extra cable which is just a lot of hassle for me especially if you have a tight bag and you can't add everything into that bag. USB-C is really something that we need and Lightning is just getting a bit old now. USB-C also has a lot of other advantages on top of Lightning for example faster transfer speed, some more faster charging even though we don't have the bricks in the boxes, that's still something people might want if they are going abroad and they have one of their old bricks. Point number three. This video is about what I want to see in the iPhone 13, so they aren't all changes, some things I want Apple to keep. For example, the sharp edges and matte finish. I really like the blue color on the iPhone 12 and it's really, really nice actually. The iPhone 12 Pro's with the matte also and as all the iPhones have the very sharp edges, I personally am a fan. I really like the design of the iPhone 4 and iPhone 5 and this brings me back to that design. So the sharp edges and the matte blue is a definite must. I really like that color and the edges, even though they are fingerprint magnets, they still look really, really nice if you do keep them clean, which is really hard to do, not gonna lie. But yeah, the matte blue and the sharp edges can stay. But point number four, adding on to the design, maybe Apple could try and innovate themselves into making a smaller notch. The notch is getting a bit outdated with the other designs that we've had in the smartphone market. For example, the hole punch cutout that we've seen on nearly every Samsung phone and a lot of Android phones. The under display camera, which the technology I guess isn't ready yet, but that is an option. We also have the pop-up cameras and there are just a load of options Apple can go to. The notch must get smaller, but I would like to keep the face ID. Adding on to the face ID though with point number five, touch ID. Touch ID is necessary in the world that we're living in, which is a pandemic. Coronavirus, we have to wear masks wherever we go. And in my specific case, if I was to use face ID and I went to a shop, I would probably have to take down my mask, then scan my face, then put back up my mask. That's just hassle. So in a world of where we are all wearing masks, Touch ID would be so, so much easier. And I'm not a fan of punching in my pin everywhere I go, especially for payments. So please bring Touch ID back. It can be either under the glass or on the power button as we have seen on the iPad Air. But Touch ID needs to come back. Touch ID is just so good. So those are the main things that I am looking for in the iPhone 13 if this is how it is which there is a slight chance of there could be but if this is how the iphone 13 looks like when it is launched well then i am jumping on to the other side i'm going to go to iphone i have a samsung galaxy s10 plus right now so i am looking to upgrade the iphone 13 may just be the shot i am looking for thank you guys for watching saf astro for the iphone 13 wishlist peace